Uh, you got some new shit. Hello again. <laughs> Hello again. These glasses are very fake. See? Are they? Ah. <laughs> I can see that we're getting continual upgrades at Planetary Guardians. That's right. But I can see. I rewatched the video the other day of me showing you my completed office. It's a very good video. <laughs> <laughs> was it was this in the middle of a uh, of work needing to be done and, and me not in the best mood <laughs> yeah yeah that's right it's funny because if people are watching at some point wow wow they're not doing anything nope 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 holy shoot now he's got a whole bunch of work to do <laughs> and what the heck is sweet doing so yeah so did you finish did you come up with the uh, multiple uh email function function no oh. no i will do so shortly <laughs> i thought that was the last thing that needed to be done uh i did do some other stuff and then i i sent a message i got super distracted because uh we went shopping real quick to get some food and at the shopping place they had they had thrown out all these giant bins they were like six feet by six feet by five feet what? uh and they were wooden bins but they had like metal on the sides and then other ones were like 100 percent metal and they were throwing them all in the garbage apparently they were all stacked up so i said holy cow can i have some of these and i go like, oh, yeah take us you know i had to take talk to three different people but eventually they're like yeah yeah you can have as many as you want so then i had to go get a drill and take them apart to fit them in the car and then uh, it took me about an hour to 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 un un uh screw all of them and, and flow them into the car and get back but you uh box very large bins yeah like imagine a pallet each of the sides is the size of a pallet okay and then they're reinforced on the corners with big with big metal brackets oh wow that's good so i'm gonna use i got three of them i'm gonna put them side by side and use them for compost very nice like a full you know professional style compost oh so that's a good, good acquisition yeah well, yep it's, yeah, that's, it's that's distracted me a little bit yep you should uh Always make sure that the needs of the community come last when you're getting some personal acquisitions, especially at needed moments. <laughs> well, my little community has to come first, you know, my little community here. <laughs> hey, guess so, what? Guess what? Up? Let me just take a look. Buttercup. Um, where is it here? It's a long pause. The values, our, our team chose values. And guess what they, they have? And they did it random. They did it uh, divination. And they had ruthlessness at infrastructure and glamour at uh, interfacing. Glamour is like to value what is the emotional equivalent of mental illusion. <laughs> so at infrastructure, ruthlessness, and at marketing, glamour like it <laughs> that is the value system of the old paradigm <laughs> the, the, the wow. structure is ruthless and they are always using glamour to dis, to, to confuse people isn't interesting that isn't that funny <laughs> so that was done while i wasn't there and that was part of uh, i think one of the reasons i wasn't there was just to see how it would go because i think i i didn't want to influence it well, sounds like it went terribly. They needed you. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's all right. Hey, guess what? I made seven videos today. I oh, made a, a video um, using the new backgrounds, and I, I came up with a six-minute intro to the game using the, uh, the one that looks like a game show. And then to in the game, which game? Um, the Planetary Guardians game. Ah. So I started to go, okay, we got to make this, you know, we got to up the, we got to up the glamour. <laughs> so <laughs> my, my, my version of upping the glamour is getting, getting your nice little backgrounds here to, to have people part of the optical illusion. They're pretty good. 
Can I play here? Can I just play you the beginning of one of them? Okay. Just to see what you think. See, see what you think of the look. Um, let me let me see if I can find this here. Go there. Gotta go there. Gotta go there. Okay, now just wait a second. I mean, <laughs> I don't know what you'll think. I don't know what anyone will think, but I, I was getting into the zone a bit or thinking, oh shit, I got it. Hmm. What's going on here? What the fuck? A plugin is required to share an iPhone iPad screen. Do you are you on an iPhone or iPad? I am not. I am on my computer. Okay, this must be some secret uh, screen there. Choose Zoom theme. I don't have a fucking thing. Okay, here we go. You ready? Welcome to Planetary Guardians. I'm your host, Captain Sweep. I'm here to assist you to move. I can't watch it. <laughs> <laughs> you only got a few seconds. Of, I like it. Um, and I'm sure you probably heard this before, but I think actually going forward, you may want to, in order to attract the largest audience and be, you know, open to, uh, people from all over the world and stuff like that. I think going forward, you may need to lose some of the costumes, including the one that you're currently wearing, because believe it or not, it will offend people. It'll offend people. Of course you're wearing like this Arab thing you know, people will assume because people assume all the time that you're either making fun of the arab people or you know something else i don't know so i'll probably offend everybody well i mean with all the various costumes you have you will offend a lot of people sure <laughs> but but this is my look what a, what it's like batman saying that you know you're gonna offend people because of your your looks or you're gonna like superheroes. No, no, because like Batman's not wearing a a particular cultural adorb, adobe, you know. I like if people who know you, they know you that you're you're a normal dude and you just like wearing weird costumes. But for people who don't know you, they're seeing that video for the first time, for example, they might just click it right off because they're like, What the hell is this racist crap? Honestly, people some people will just be like, Whoa, that's weird. And then they'll blacklist planetary guardians altogether. They'll tell their friends not to use it, etc. Just saying. So you think I got to do them all over again? Well, I think you should approach it in a more business sense or in a more new paradigm sense where, sure, one day it'll be okay to wear anything you want. Anyone can wear anything they want, you know, but it's still not like that. And it, it's not going to be like that soon. And I think, yeah, a lot of people that will trigger, that will trigger things in their head, right? If I was just this. I'd say that's too slacker looking now because you're just wearing a t-shirt. I think you should dress up. Uh, you know, in your suit, you look good in your business suit. Yeah, even that—that's good. That's pretty good. Yeah. 
Well, I gotta do and maybe even a hat. Of... What? A hat or not a hat. It doesn't matter. But I think you look good in one of your hats. Hat. Huh. But you also look good like that. Up to you. I'm just thinking, yeah, like a yeah, suit jacket looks good. Yeah, yeah. Any hat or no hat, but I think just the suit jacket and like, what do you wear during the Lissy L meetings in Zoom? Kind of like pretty, it's pretty cash, like with a t shirt. Like but do you wear the other thing that you were just wearing? No, I haven't been. Yeah, you should probably, I think you should act like that as if you act towards those people, right? Because yeah, you'd know that it would probably offend them or make them think weird well, things of you. And we don't want people to be offended or think weird things about the the project, the the you know thing you're building, really. But but I like I, I saw Captain Sweep as kind of like this character that's kind of like the host of the game, and he is eccentric. That's part of the whole thing. Like we got to bring humor in. We got to bring in. Yeah, uh, but but humor is a very conditional thing, right? Some humor, some people like other humor. Other people don't like uh and then there's some humor that that uh everyone likes and there's some humor that no one likes but yeah i know you're trying to create the character and everything so, but so I, think how about, I think you need to separate that from from presenting it from your whole thing <laughs> well how about okay i'll do i'll do a straight one for Liz CL. i'll redo all the videos and but I get to do a Planetary Guardians very secret plan by Captain Sweep. It's just Captain Sweep, and and he's ready to take the flak. He's ready to he's because he, he's going in a it's it's, it's a comedy show. I know that's what you've that's what you've wanted to do, but you could always change it now <laughs> and make is it a he, comedy show that does that just just take away that one element is what I'm saying. You mean me? <laughs> No, no, take away the one element where you're wearing uh, things from other cultures. Well, what about, okay. Yeah, I think that's fine. That's I mean, just you being you, silly. You accept this. Yeah. So this what is, is it. It uh, looks like a pirate hat to me. Yeah, it's a bad Halloween pirate, pirate outfit. Yeah, that's cool. So you'd be okay with this? But I just, don't think it matters. But the culture, it's just that it's a cultural appropriate thing. Well, of course, yeah. It's like <laughs> if you're wearing like, a, you know, like a bunch of Native American stuff on your head, it'd probably be also offensive to other people. Well, I, think, <laughs> I think no matter what I do, I'm going to be offensive to people. But you could reduce it a little bit. You could, you could just, you could just, I'm just saying, remove that one, that one thing. Is like uh, that's don't my wear anything whole, that's specifically that's my specific thing. to any culture. But, th but that's my whole thing. It's. Oh. Yeah, no, I mean, like, wear the pirate hats, wear the weird masks, all that. That's fine. Just not the the Arab thing and, and like the racial stuff. That's my only advice. Doesn't matter. Eventually, we'll have some sort of media team, and they'll be the face of Planetary Guardians, I would imagine. And you'll be the centric creator and and uh, person who comes on once in a while and is is like also the mascot, I guess, because that's what you're going for. I'm assuming. Mascot. Well, yeah. <laughs> Captain you, Sweep is like the mascot. Gonna, you're gonna start talking to my shadow, my friend. <laughs> that, that's Captain Sweep's one of Captain Sweep's puppets, which is a whole other thing. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry. Right, anyway, whatever you, you know what I'm saying. It just if if you don't if you wouldn't wear it for a Lissy L meeting, I would say you shouldn't wear it for the world. That's all. You know, treat the world with the same kind of like, uh, not respect, but you know, well, treat the world with respect, I guess. But you know, pretend that those these are all also potential clients, potential people who you know are gonna, you know, be using the system. I don't know. Whatever. You know what I'm saying. All right, I'm gonna walk around and make coffee while we're talking here. I'm gonna get some chai. This is depressing.
you will see that you got this. You, did you get it yesterday? No. Oh, really? Oh, no. Whoa. I got the big one. You got two small ones? Uh -huh. Oh, so I had this the whole time. Oh my God. I didn't realize. I just saw it in the back of the cupboard. What's going on? Hey, sorry. Huh? So a couple of quick questions. Hey, um, did you did you tell us yell anything yet last night? No. Okay, cool. I, I uh I thought we should because uh, I guess you could be sort of stopping my classic big mistake. And um All right. We got to help each What's other with, with our big, well, just like, again, like the Arab thing, maybe, maybe it's not a good idea. Uh, so when we oh, help each other with those big mistakes. I don't think it's a big mistake. It's just, uh... hey. <laughs> No, they, they haven't communicated with me at all, which is a little strange. Ever since I said that you have to do your own spell, <laughs> I think I don't think they like that. No, I don't think they like that. Eh? I, I doubt that would be possible. You know that part of you know that I want to do a game show where, where I'd be in a coffee shop, and the game show would be called "Spot the Terrorist." And I because oh because part of the look is just to so overemphasize the idea of terrorism and sort of dressing like terrorists, and if you're wearing something like that, you're a terrorist kind of thing, right? Well, yeah. I mean, that's kind of a. I know what you're saying. Uh, yeah, that joke is is is. Actually, that joke is 20 years old now. I know, but nobody's nobody's doing it. Well, it's because it's 20 years old. Right, but I'm now still... everyone just accepts that there's terrorists everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I just figured at some point I'd be such a target that uh, I might as well just paint the target right on me, you know? Different, interesting approach. Well, I, I find the, the, the norm does not know how to deal with crazy. They, they can deal with most things, but they don't know how to deal with crazy, except, I guess, put you in an institution. Well, there's crazy, and then there's just, uh, you know, there's other types of things. 
Like, Igno ignorance? Like, uh, ignorance. And, uh, <laughs> you know, illegal. Well, it makes stuff. you look good. Makes me look good? Yeah, I make a lot of people look good just by comparison, you know? No, no, no. <laughs> by association, you still make us look bad. Okay, you're right. <laughs> See, that's part of the conversation. Nah, it doesn't matter. Obviously, um, yeah, obviously, I'm not offended. I'm just thinking, you know, like, I don't know. It was just a suggestion. I think it's, I think it's worth thinking about. Well, because like uh, the the Lebanese will or Lebanese, the the um, Palestinian uh, product team person we have, for, for example, may be offended by that costume. I don't know. If she's watched your videos or not, but maybe she will and be like, "Holy cow, what the heck is this?" Maybe because she, she just I don't know. I mean, she seems pretty like normal person. I think she probably just think it's you being weird. She but. has a, a very good sense of humor. Yeah, well, that's well, good. She, she seems to to me. She's got a. <laughs> She's lovely. She's very, she's, uh, that's going to be helpful. Yeah. Yeah. She's, she's, I think she's the, the glue that could help the whole team go forward because she's, she seems to be able to handle a lot, has a very <clears throat> sharp mind, um, very relaxed, very, uh, open to learn and, uh, very pleasant energy. Oh, that's good. Okay. Yes, I, I watched the rest of the video that because I'd forgotten that you talked for another half an hour after I left that day. So I watched the, the rest of that video, I think, yesterday. Oh, yeah. Before. And yeah, it looked pretty good. And she had some, she sounds definitely like she knows what to do and like that she will. And that she's also like 100% on board and is hoping to turn this into a profitable thing so she can get a job out of it because her yeah. job is going to be in. Yeah. So it sounds like she's actually fully invested and also believes that we can do this. And turn it into a business. So that's good. No, she um, she saw it like she she really like I <clears throat> it, it it had been a while since I had sort of really gone through the cards with someone to really show you know what it is and how they connect and how they all work together and uh, we spent about two and a half hours together. Oh wow! And <laughs> she did in the middle of it kind of go. She I could just see that she, you know the. I don't know whether the lights were turning on, but just she was understanding what the pieces were and how they fit kind of thing. Nice. And I, nice. Okay. So I just made contact with her in Facebook. Yep. Okay, good. I'm wondering... Um, I think you should start a LinkedIn account also. I should what? Professional LinkedIn account. I had one and I, I removed everything from it in a fit of anger. Yeah, you told me that before, but I still don't think you should make one. <laughs> just don't I, use it for just don't use it for the same thing that you use Facebook for. That's what I would suggest. I would well, suggest thanks. use it as like a professional thing. Don't even ever post on it. Thanks, man. Like way to point that one out. it's just good because if we have planetary guardians as a facebook or a linkedin page like we do right um yeah. that that all of a sudden got us so many volunteers and people that are you know the only thing they've seen is that is that linkedin page most of them probably all of them so they're like they're that's it's just a face it just needs to be a regular face that says hey we, we're ready to do business we're legitimate uh, organization that's willing to hire you as a volunteer and eventually as an employee and stuff, right? But if you throw yourself on Facebook and LinkedIn as well, I'll just put your face on there. You don't even have to post anything. I'll just make you the admin on there. And then there, now we got two employees, right? This looks better. <laughs> and then you can talk to them as well. You can review their resumes and stuff. And we get people like, oh, that is useful, I think. That is in terms of uh, <laughs> nothing like I want to do more than talk to another 60 people. A week. Exactly. Yeah, there you go. This is what I need. 
<laughs> well, I mean. Okay, no, then, Mr. Sparty Pats, we should make a video for the facilitators to show them what they're coming into. Yeah, so they understand the system we mean. Oh, yeah. yeah, okay. You yeah, that is good. We're gonna have to do that. So there's gonna be a lot of work that we write, but probably try to address this uh, with some legal things. Yeah, yeah, that's another thing. Yeah. I'm not gonna see about that, how, how we still have to register as a nonprofit or a company of some sort so that we can well, you have own to. things. You have to. Me and my bestie, we so. had a company and we have to register that one as well. Otherwise, you know, people just can't continue to steal our ideas and our copyright. We're going to be going everywhere because well, we're not, you know, yeah. We may be the best able to do that job, but there's a copycat everywhere. They may prefer, they may produce a lame or very bad quality services, but other people don't know. Most 80%, they won't know. Yeah. Yeah. Plus, in order to get money or to pay money, we have to have a business. Yeah. Well, I told you about that guy who knows how to set his own country up, eh? I would avoid doing anything to do with him as far as the planetary guardians go, though. Not not the system that we're building. It, it, if you build something outside the system, the system will destroy it. He thinks there's a way not to. Oh. Well, could be right, but didn't you say the government was already after him? A little bit. Oh well. Well, I think I think that we need we need two. We need uh, we need or, an organization that's in, and we need an organization that's out. Yeah, that's why I, I think it's very important not to integrate everything. Have a, have a separate entity that's nothing to do with it. That you know, I, I, you can play around with that stuff. Um, you know, we don't have to hide them from each other. They just don't have to be connected and integrated together. That's all. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'm super interested in, that, in knowing what he's talking about. What's going on there for sure. Because it's, um, it's... at the same time, I mean, I don't know. I've, I've gone down that rabbit hole a few times on some other avenues, you know, like the artificial person and the birth certificate and other things. And it's always been confusion actually in the end like people get confused and actually there's some things that that are uh, true about that stuff and some things people are just you know passing around rumors on the internet and not well, really ever checking the facts well the, i know but the thing about building a new paradigm is nothing is going to be built into that old paradigm at some point right there's got to be some newness that is not connected so we i think we need to build again sort of one of both because I, I i'm gonna have a web tv show with him and we're going to go week by week and and see what happens. I mean, maybe, maybe. I mean, I know Josh Jasol and some other people have another angle they're coming in from a lawful point of view, but I just have this intuitive sense that Cameron's figured something out, and I've had it for quite a while. Um, I don't know if that means much, but that's how I generally put my information together. I think uh, the two key things about building a new paradigm, a new system for the whole world. One of them is building the system, how it should work, how it should be. The other part is actually creating um, creating kind of a negative uh, vacuum type of system, or not system, but a an approach so that this, this new system is anchored inside the old system, but then it, it, it's automatically just drawing everything in, out of it into this one and, uh -huh. and converting it, right? It has to flip it, like in order to... Like if, you know, until money is gone, the new system still needs, we still need to, to pay for some stuff to get it going. Right. So that's money that we're taking out of this old system and putting into the new system and eventually can get deleted or something. <clears throat> right. No, I, I agree. That sounds, sounds very, very good. So are you ready, my friend? To make a video? Yeah, to make a video. Um, I think we're ready to make a mock video. A yes. mock video? Okay. A pretend we'll see how it goes kind of thing. Yeah, let's let's go Actually, for gold and then and then review it and be like, okay, well, we need to obviously do this. And I was stuttering here, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, maybe two or three times we'll get it right. Okay. Okay. I'll turn that.